Yes, I've always known about this place. It's just that until now I never wanted anything from any of you. Let's establish some parameters. I'm not Spider-Man, and I'm not the Punisher. They represent the extreme ends of the same costume spectrum. I'm Moon Knight, and you all know that means one thing. No one in this bar, myself included, knows precisely what I am capable of. I beat the Avengers. Imagine what I can do to any one of you. Now, with the bona fides established, I'm going to say one word, and then I will leave. Zodiac. Zodiac? Zodiac. I'm not familiar with the name. I've heard of the Zodiac Cartel, of course. But I don't know a Zodiac singular. That's the thing, Dr. Sturman. No one has. No one who will still talk to me, that is. As you might have guessed, I'm not exactly on the Avengers Hanukkah card list. Though oddly enough, Ben Grimm never fails to send me one every year. I think he needs to meet more Jewish superheroes. Yeah, Zodiac. Z-O-D-I-A-C. Bag over his head? Sid Vicious Chain? What? They don't have sex pistols in... Yeah, like a chain in a padlock. As a necklace. Yeah. All that and a used car salesman suit. Powers? Is being a complete bastard a power? Because that's what he's got. He's a game player. Likes to get close, likes to talk. This isn't his first rodeo, and yet you don't know anything about him? What does he want with Mark? I mean, isn't that why I'm calling you? Why else do you have me watching him for you? Come on, come on, pick up. Calling it an early night, 8-Ball? Yeah! Or did you hear something at the bar that scared you? What do you think? I think he knows something. Well, yeah. <laughs> I guess there's a first time for everything, isn't there, eh, Paul? Oh, no. Why don't we have a little chat about Zodiac, eh, Paul? <laughs> Just a friendly chat. <laughs> Just the two of us. <laughs> hey, what's that all about? It's a challenge. Or a valentine. Or both. But whichever it is, I don't have time for it right now. A new villain, perhaps? I don't think so. He was too good, too confident, when someone first decides to put on a mask and hurt people on either side of the line. It takes time to find your footing. There was none of that in Zodiac. Howley, Clark, that thing with Soldier, all his jabs at me, the ones I survived, they weren't failures, not to him. They were tests, games. He was pleased I lived through them. He said I had potential. Potential for what? If he's playing games, what's the prize? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. What's that, April? I hear you over the sound of the industrial car shredder. Manslaughter, Marsta! Kill the power, soldier! You got it, Mr. Knight. You were saying... Manslaughter, Marsta! We were playing poker a couple months back. Told me that one time it was screwed up with a guy called Zodiac. That who you were trying to call? Marsdale? Look, I just thought I could make a couple bucks, you know? Tip him off. Come on, Moon Knight, don't kill me, man. I don't do anything! We both know that's not true, eh, Paul? You're not innocent. Ah! You wouldn't have really shredded him, would you? If I was really going to drop him in the shredder, I'd have put him in feet first. You don't get it, do you, Moon Man? I don't feel pain. You can't beat anything out of me. You don't feel pain. You're missing out. Tell me how to find Zodiac, Marsdale, before I start cutting on you. You don't get it. I owe my life to Zodiac. You're ready to die for him. You do what you gotta do, Moon Man, and I'll do what I do. You can't feel pain. Cute. You immune to concussions, too? 
because I'll keep bouncing your brain off the inside of your own skull until you forget your own name. Um, I'm no punk like Cloud or the rest, rest of the crew was. Um, you can put me in the ground. Won't make any difference. I'm Manslaughter Marsdale, and I don't snitch. You know what? I believe you. See you around, Marsdale. I've got an appointment with a friend of yours. You're an easy man to find, clown. Not a real great quality for a guy in your line of work. Not what a guy in my line of work wants to talk to you. You know I can see in the dark, right? You know I can't, right? Ah. Gross. Damn. No, we didn't get anywhere. Marsdale would go to the grave before he'd rat, and Clown's dead. Zodiac got to him first, cut his head off, took the damn head with him. Look, I don't feel great about this. I understand that you think he's dangerous, but Mark is my friend. Hell, he didn't drop 8-Ball into an industrial car shredder. That's something, right? I know. I know. I'm sorry, Gria. I know this is difficult for you. But Mark Spector is too dangerous to be left unwatched. I'm worried about him, Doc. The boy's just on the wrong path, you know? So really, I guess you could call all of these high spirits and monkey shines. Hell, I guess you could call them an intervention for old Mark. So let's talk about how we're going to get this promising young man back on track.